it's frustrating. It kills their confidence. Kids in these demographics don't need that. Nikki Jones, a Tulsa teacher, made headlines in the spring for refusing to give a test to her class. Now the state PTA voting tomorrow on a resolution to boycott third to eighth grade tests that are not federally mandated. We met them on, you know, on the Capitol steps and said enough already. Our children deserve better. Our teachers deserve better. Let's do something. We weren't heard. Jeffrey Corbett, the president of the Oklahoma PTA, says this resolution is the next step, making it clear there more than 53,000 members agree state testing has gone too far. This is big for us. Our children are winding up on medication for stress, for anxiety. It's a response to state tests that left many districts and students reeling. In Tulsa, about 33% of third graders did not pass their state reading tests last year. After a lot of effort and focus of teachers, this year the number of unsatisfactory scores was cut by about 5%. Still, Corbett says these tests come at too great a cost. We can assess our children in the classroom and still know how they're doing and how our teachers are doing and not go through some of these rigorous tests.